This is our side trail that we walked out on. We're headed back to trail. This is where we left off. Good morning, guys. We are headed up to Franconia Ridge. And right now we have some blue sky, so we're hoping that holds for us because it's gonna be beautiful if it does. Now we climb. Jonathan's already wanting to take a break. I didn't say I wanted to take a break. <laughs> I don't lie to these guys. I said kidding. it's a good sitting rock. I'm gonna sit down a minute. It is a good sitting rock. It was at, right at butt height. So we're oh, going. We're going up. There's no switch back and it's just as far as the eye can see so you just plug away at it consistently Until a good sitting rock comes, then you can have <laughs> we're getting close to the top we're making actually really good time Should be above tree line in no time. Jonathan's got some Verizon LTE, so he's trying to get a video to finish uploading. Man, it's hard to get him out here in the woods. It is. It's remote. Even town has horrible sun. Look at that sunshine. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, we made it up most ooh, ooh. of the climb. Hey, look, y'all, I'm still alive. Who would have thunk? <laughs> you are. Oh, a flat spot. I guess you'd say what can make me feel this way, my girl. <laughs> Talking about my girl. Say, bro. <laughs> <Woo -hoo. laughs> if you can't tell, we are happy to see the sun. <laughs> well, I didn't know it existed anymore. Yeah, we thought maybe it had just decided to quit on us. Yeah. But she's back, baby. Oh, but we did get up super duper early this morning because we had a little bit of a drive to get back to the trailhead. Plus, did we, you hear that? A drive. we had nearly a mile side trail to get back to the AT. So, we're still a little... I'm, I'm starting to wake up. Yeah, uh, a much needed zero, even though the weather was awesome. Yeah. But... But it, we had to, like, it was yeah. just like our bodies were like, okay. And I think it was also because we decided to quit using our trekking poles. And well, we didn't decide, the mountain decided for us. It was just too hard to use them. Yeah, so that puts a lot more strain on your muscles and your stabilizer muscles and everything. <coughs> so our well, last slack pack, she didn't. Yeah. She kept up with our pace, so... My she legs really tired. were toast. But yeah. Oh, it was awesome. Lincoln's a great town. We had. Um, oh, yeah, I wish I could go back. Yeah. <laughs> We are point three from the top of Little Haystack Mountain. We are going straight up, but honestly, this climb has not been bad at all. It's been mellow as jack. Yeah. 
But you know, a lot can happen in point three. Yeah, we found the fuse in point two is the worst part. But it's definitely not been moose lock. Look behind you. Oh. That's awesome. I think we saw that from the road. Oh, I love climbing without trek poles. <laughs> it's very freeing to climb without trek poles. <laughs> more efficient. Yeah, you can bear crawl, whatever you gotta do. Faster. Yep. It just keeps getting more epic. Yeah, it does. How in the world? Guys, this is, this is gonna bring me to freaking tears. It's so gorgeous. This is insane. This is awesome. It's so awesome. <laughs>
Mount Lincoln. We do have some clouds coming in. Look how fast. I love that bird. Yes, your voice is so pretty. Getting back in the tree line. But there's still some amazing views. It's warmer down here and no wind, so took off my rain jacket slash wind layer. All right, now we're gonna go up to Garfield.
Kind of sounds like thunder. It is. We're about to get over it. Possibly. We may never actually see it. Hopefully not. So we were going to stay at Garfield Ridge Campsite. There's a nice water source before you go up the path to the camp. But it's early. It's about 1.30. So we're just going to keep moving and find a stealth spot for tonight. This is the craziness. It's so slick. Rain, rain, go away. Don't come back ever again. <laughs> right? Way over there. That's top of South Twin. The one on the left? Yep. Wow. And we're going to go up over this and then we're down gonna, that ridge. We're going to skirt the side of this up to that hut. So they don't take us over the top? Not that one. That one we do. That's South Twin. How far you guys want to go today? Right now, my muscles are trying to quit on me. When okay. we get to that hut, I'm going to eat what I've got left and take a recovery drink and see what, what I say. Because from that hut, yeah, we have to go up. Yeah. I wasn't sure whether we can we yeah, we'll break it or not. Oh, good. Good. You're getting oh, oh hung no. up right there. Wow. <laughs> Perfect. <Save laughs> yeah, you just to save the save the life. <laughs> we made it. We made it to Gilhead Hut. And it's not raining. The sun is shining. Yeah, I think rain's gone for the day. For real this time. So we're gonna That's AT that way. Yeah. That's where we will go, but we're gonna take a break at Galehead Hut. Awesome. Nice view. Oh sweet, we don't even have a filter. So we stopped for snacks and water at the hut here, and now we're going to climb again up South Twin. Oh, Al wants some. <laughs> <laughs> has a pinhole in his flask. <laughs> he got, it's going to keep you cool. You're getting misted. You are. <laughs> Head straight up again. It's a butt burner. Burning all kind. <laughs> It's just point eight up here, y'all, but it is straight up. And it looks like we're about to break the tree line. What's different about this mountain is that the rocks are so big. Big steps up. Ooh, feels like air conditioning. Almost to the top. Ooh. We're also carrying all our water for camp because there's no water source. A little heavier than normal. Top of South Twin, y'all. Yeah, 
see it. The sunshine's just moving like a laser beam. Whew, I'm so glad we got those views this morning. It's getting hazy. This is beautiful though. Wow, it's clear over there. All right. Nice and cool up here. Wow. Whoa. Are you serious? All right, so we're going down South Twin, and we are on a mission to find a camp spot for tonight. Washington over there. There's Hawk. So many things. About to make some ramen. Maybe we can incinerate a few of these mosquitoes. Oh yeah. Oh, it's on a lane. That'll do. What you eating? Nothing. I run on pure stubbornness. <laughs> I heard that when we got one. I believe that. Hawk, what are you eating? Macaroni and cheese ramen. Nice. Blah, blah. Jonathan's finishing my li liquid in my ramen bag. Oh, it's like some old lady sharded in this thing. All hail. <laughs> it's hailing. <laughs> <laughs> 